Hey everyone, I will be showing you the best easy clothing glitches that work after the latest patch 1.67. Now I will be letting you know which works for the female male character and also which works for the old and new gen consoles. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new and share it with your friends. Now for the first clothing glitch, this works for old and new gen and also works for the female male character. I will be showing you on how to put on any racing equipment onto any saved outfit. Now for this glitch, you won't need to delete no outfits and make sure you have your saved outfit ready to go and you will need to make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Now make your way over to the top section with your saved outfit and the only requirement for this is you will need a t-shirt that lets you equip a utility vest and don't worry the utility vest will disappear after the glitch ends. Now you will need to go over to the utility vest and buy the peach plate carrier number 43. And make your way over to the front counter. Now save your current outfit on the first outfit slot. Now back out once, go over to the high school overalls and buy anyone that have a gas mask on. Doesn't really matter, just buy one. Now make your way over to the nearest telescope so you can do the telescope glitch. Now basically do the telescope glitch, run past it, hit right on the d-pad and basically what you need to do is apply the same outfit we just made once. Close the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope and you should see the gas mask merge onto the saved outfit like this. If you're wondering on how I got a high rank 16 trillion dollars, modded KDs, super fast run, all these modded outfits and this modded account, well I got this from hyperresupply.com. This is the number one boosting platform for services for GTA 5 online. You can buy modded cars, modded outfits, modded accounts. If you want to add stuff onto your current account, they have stuff. They have all different types of accounts. And also, if you want to even save more money at checkout, use code REBEL to get 10% off your next order. Now, go over to the master afterwards. Save your current outfit on the last outfit slot. Apply the saved outfit we just made four times very quickly. Wait for the orange loading screen to show up and disappear. Once it does, fully close out your GT5 application and reload it. Then load it into an invite-only session afterwards and open up your pause menu once you load in and go over to the missions and start up the mission called a tight end of a job now on the second job menu like this just go over to confirm settings launch the mission by yourself now you should be loading inside of the job mission like this with no utility vest and a gas mask on still what you need to do is go over to the closest ammunition store on the map now once you're there go inside of the ammunition store save your current outfit on the first office slot now back out from the office section, you will need to pull up your phone and quit the job, do the jobs list through your phone. Once you do load into the random lobby, make your way back over to the ammunition store, go over to the office section, go over to the air racing suits, buy any air racing suit that you do like. Basically, we will be getting the components off the air racing suit to your saved outfit. After you chose it, open up a pause menu, go over to bookmark jobs and start up the mission called Itchy G Thing. Now on the second job menu like this, put the clothing on player saved outfits, invite at least one person to help you out and once they do join, just launch the mission. Now on this job menu on the owned outfits, click one to the right. Now both they are ready up so the mission can start. Now once you do load in, you should have the saved outfit like this with the gas mask. Just wait about 5 seconds or so, pull up your phone and quit the job, do the job just through your phone. Now you should be loading in with the air racing suit like this you will need to find any street vehicle off the street register as secure reserve and on the secure reserve management on the style enter the vehicle on the style click one to the right and one to the left close the interaction menu and exit the vehicle and you should see the air racing suit equipment transferred over to your saved outfit as long as you save this as an outfit it will stick like this video subscribe if you're new and let's move on to the other clothing glitch of this video now for this clothing glitch, I will be showing you on how to get a topless female outfit. Now this only works for the female character and also works for old and new gen. Now with the female character, just make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Now once you're there, go over to the front counter, go over to the business pants and buy the Liberty. This one. Now you will need to make your way over to the top section. And at the top section, you will need to go over to the overcoats. And buy any overcoat that lets you have no bra on like this. And basically it will stick. You should see no bra forever. 
Now the cool thing about this is as long as you save this as an if it, it will stick as you can see in this video. Now don't forget to like this video and let's move on to the other clothing glitch of this video. I will be showing you on how to get a fully invisible chest with any color racing gloves and you could put this onto any saved outfit or your saved joggers. This works for the male character only and only the old gta version but if you're doing on new gen content if you have the old gta version you can still do it now go over to any clothing cell on the map save your current outfit on the last alpha slot open up the pause menu go over to swap character and accept that alert that shows up on the screen now this method will delete your saved outfits now once you do load into a small room like this hover above the second slot character and push edit and if it says something about copying the rank just copy the rank now on the edit part, if it's a male character, go over to the sex, put it a female, put save and continue. And if it's a female character, just go over to save and continue. Now once you do load into a random lobby, open up your pause menu and load into an invite only session. Then make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Go over to the accessories and make sure you remove any sort of accessories that is on the female character. Now you would need to go over to the gloves. And on the gloves. You will need to buy the light woolen armor number 32. Now make your way over to the pants section. Go over to the sport pants and buy the spotted muscle pants. The first one. Now you will need to make your way over to the shoe section. Now go over to the high heel boots and buy the deluxe midnight combat number 24. Now go over to the gun running t-shirts at the top section and buy the blue digital t-shirt. Should be the last one, number 60. Now go over to the work jackets and buy the peach camo clothes field, number 38. Now make your way over to the front counter. Save your current outfit on the second outfit slot and just name it whatever you want. Now you will need to make your way over to the top section go over to the tactical jackets and buy the khaki tactical blossom should be the last one number 79 now go over to the bikinis and buy the black bikini number 27 now what you need to do is go over to the front counter save your current outfit on the third outfit slot now back out from the front counter you will need to open up your interaction menu choose the option to easy way out to be at the bottom of your interaction menu once you do spawn in open up your pause menu go over to online go over to creator and accept that alert that shows up on the screen now on this blue menu go over to creator race click tutorial and accept that alert that shows up on the screen now open up your pause menu go over to online go over to choose character and accept that alert now you should be loading inside of a small room like this hover above the female character on slot number two and delete her after deleting her you will need to hover above the male slot character and return to the GT5 story mode. Now once you're in story mode like this, just open up your pause menu, go over to online and load into an invite only session. Now once you do load in, just make your way over to any clothing store on the map. Save your current outfit on the last outfit slot, which is slot number 20. Now once you've done that, basically go over to the racing jersey at the top section and buy any racing jerseys that will match with the color joggers. So basically we will be getting the gloves off this t-shirt basically. So get any racing jersey that matches with the color outfit or your color joggers. Now open up your pause menu, go over to online, go to your bookmark jobs and start up the mission called ATG thing. If you didn't have it, you can always tell someone to invite you into it. Now on the owned outfit selection right here, put the clothing on player saved outfits. Invite at least one person to help you out. And once they do join, just launch the mission. On this menu right here on the owned outfits, click two to the right and one to the left. Now both of you are ready up, so the mission can start. Now once you do load in, you should have the modded outfit. And basically what you need to do is steal any of these two vehicles and make your way over to your apartment building. And if it doesn't let you, blow yourself up in the blue marker and it should let you afterwards. Now delete the first two saved outfits, save your current outfit on the 19 outfit slot. Now pull up your phone and quit the job to the job list to your phone. Now basically, once you do load it into a random lobby, you should have a random outfit. What you 
you need to do is apply the saved outfit on slot number 19 and you should see the modded outfit and it was sick because it just saved like this video subscribe if you're new catch you on tomorrow's video peace